How's everybody doing? My name is Mike from Roots Canine Training. Today I got Bentley with me and uh, my last video I showed a little bit how to get a small dog to do the down position. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, show you guys that again in a little more detail. So the first thing I'm going to do is get him to sit. Sit. So you have him in a sit position. Now what I'm going to do to get him down to the ground is if I just pull the leash down he doesn't necessarily know that I want him to go down. So to get him to know what the idea of down is, this is how I do it. I take both my hands, I put them on his front paws, sit. I put them on his front paws, I pull his paws out, and my left, my left forearm is gonna go down on his back, just like this, to help push his back down so it gets, it's easier for them to go in the down position. If you, don't, if you don't do it like you want them to go in the down position, they're gonna resist more. So you wanna make it as smooth as possible for them. You want them to feel good about it. So the next best thing to do is I'm going to put my knee on the leash so in case he tries to go anywhere, he can't get too far. So he's in a sit, and here we go. I'm going to say down. I grab his front feet, and I push him right down. Good down. No, down. And so my left forearm is resting on his back. I'm not trapping him, but I'm, I'm, I'm doing it firmly. Good boy. Good down. I'm doing it firmly so that he knows what I want. Okay, sit. Good boy. And so here we go again. Down. Take his front paws and my left forearms on his back, down, good, down. So that's where I want him to, no, down. So I just take his paws, again, down, good, down. Okay, sit. I only want him to do it for a few seconds. I just want him to get the idea of where down is. And I want him to start being comfortable going down. He's very frantic, he's very fearful. So uh, fearful dogs want to be on their feet. They want to be able to move out of the way of anything that's coming. That's why he's shaking and he's always looking around. He's always kind of aware of what's happening. So we want to get him to relax a little bit more. He's got to know some of these commands. So and with, with these dogs, you want to keep it short and you want them uh, to be successful doing it. Down. Good. Down. Good boy. Good down. Okay, sit. Good boy. Good sit. Down. Good. Good down, buddy. Good down. Okay, sit. Down. Good down. Good boy. So this, again, is the thing you want to do before just using leash pressure. Okay, sit. So if we try leash pressure now. Down. Down. So he's almost got it. He's almost going down. No, down. So... Good boy, good down. So using his front paws and taking him out and pushing him down to the ground is what got me able to lead him down to the ground with the leash. So that's a step you need to take sometimes before just using uh, the leash pressure. Okay, sit down. So now there's a little more resistance. Good boy, good. And if they resist, you just hold steady until they perform a uh, the command and if he was not to do that and I couldn't get him to go down with leash pressure what I would do is simply go back to taking his paws out and using my forearm until he gets the idea. You have to uh, move slow sometimes. You have to move at a pace that's good for them. 